What is going on guys, my name is James and today I'm going to bring you a Sony Vegas 12 tutorial on transitions. First thing you want to do is open up your videos on the timeline, so I'm going to get two different videos and put them on the timeline. You can have just one video and split it in half by pressing the S key and put the transition in wherever you want it on one single video clip. Or you can just have two different video clips and make the transition go with each other, so that's what I'm going to do. So the first thing you want to do, so the second thing you want to do is on the left here you'll see transitions and you just press the tab and it'll come up with in all, it'll come up with all these transitions. So you have 3D transitions, your just basic transitions like band or flash, swirls, slides, pushes, everything you can think of, zoom, blinds, everything. So I'm just going to show you a couple and uh, yeah, I, I'm just going to use the default ones. Of course, you can see there's loads more to choose from. It depends what you want on your video, but I'm just going to show you the default zoom. You drag and drop it in between the clips where the where they join. It'll say a little plus sign next to the arrow. You let go, and it'll come up with the settings folder, and it would have added your transition to the video. You can muck around with the settings if you want, but I would leave them as default as you can get pretty complicated sometimes, but as I said you can do whatever you want so I'm going to show you the transition here I'm not going to play it as it will lag heavily as it's not rendered so I'll just skip a couple of frames and as you can see the video pop the zoom of the other video popped up and it zoomed into the screen like so so when it's playing it will look super smooth and you're about to see it by frame by frame it'll just go super smoothly alright that's that transition that's a zoom transition I'll show you another transition let me try and find one so this, the uh, the spin the fly in fly out transition it's a pretty cool tundra transition as in it just flies into the screen as you can see now and then hits the screen that's a really cool professional effect uh, they look quite nice in some movies and other stuff like that so yeah as you can see there's loads and loads and loads of these so if you want to use any of them you click on them and you just drag and drop them into the space below and yeah that's it for this tutorial guys if this tutorial helped you remember to leave a like and a comment and subscribe if you haven't already see you later